Oh. Boy, y'all scared me. As you can see, I'm grooming myself. And you have facial hair too. So I'm going to give you five reasons why you should learn how to cut your facial hair. Hit it. So tubers, you have facial hair. And facial hair can be a beautiful thing because ladies love the facial hair. We all know that. Well, if you don't know it now, now you know it. But the women love the facial hair. Whether it's gray, whether it's black, whether you dye it blonde, they love it anyway. So I'm going to give you five reasons why you should learn how to cut your own facial hair. Number one, you save money. Now, ah, this is hard for me to say, and the barbers probably will kick my ass for this one. But you save money, so you don't need to go to the barber shop all the time. You can cut your own facial hair, you can design it, you do it however you want. But if you don't know how to cut your facial hair and you want to look like your groom, then you got to keep going to the barber. And you're spending money that you don't need to spend. And I hate to say that, and I'm a barber myself. Some of my clients might be watching this that don't cut their facial hair. I may be taking money out of my pocket but I'm here for you. So learning how to cut your own facial hair will save you money. You can cut it as much as you want to. Number two, you stay groomed. When you know how to cut your facial hair, it always looks nice and on point. It's always lined up nice, like my luscious gray beard, your goatee is lined up, your mustache, whatever type of facial hair you have, you always stay groomed so you look good for the ladies and you just look like a respectable human being. So cut your own facial hair, stay groomed, stay looking good because she's going to treat you good. Number three, you can change your look. When you know how to cut your facial hair, one day you may have a beard and you're like, you know what? I want to cut it off. I want to cut it into a goatee. Now you got a goatee. Or you got a mustache and you're like, yo, I want to grow a goatee. And while your goatee is growing, you can line it up so it looks good. But you can change your look anytime you want to when you know how to cut your own facial hair. Number four, you may have a last minute shave. Y'all wonder what do I mean by that? What if you're talking to a woman on the phone? But see, a lot of y'all don't talk on the phone anymore. You're texting. So I'm going to speak in your language. So you might be texting a woman and you're talking to her and she's like, hey, I want to see you now. And you and you don't look good. Your, your face is scruffy. You haven't touched anything in a minute. So now you got the girl and she's like, I want to see you now. Come over. I want you. Go get your trimmers. It's the last minute. Zzz, and line your facial hair up. And you go over her house looking like a champ. You walk in there like a big dog. You walk in there with confidence because you done groom your own facial hair at the last minute, baby. And when she sees that confidence, the rest is history. I ain't gonna get into that. I'm gonna let you get into that. <laughs> Number five, you can teach your kid. Now you might be young watching this. I don't know how old you are. You may be older, who knows? But that's a bond when a father can show his son how to shave. When a father can grab a pair of trimmers and show his son how to line up his little peach fuzz. That's a bonding moment for father and son. So even if you're 18, 19 watching this video and you don't have any kids, but you learn how to cut your face right now, so later on in life, like around after 30, about 31, 32, when you have a kid, you've had 11 years 
of cutting your facial hair. When your kid gets that age of cutting his facial hair, you can teach him it's a beautiful bonding moment. They do bonding moments like that in commercials. Father and son in the bathroom, he's teaching them how to shave. So the moral of the story is, fellas, it will make your life easier if you learn how to shave your own facial hair. Subscribe. I'm going to leave on the video three trimmers that I like that you can use to line up your facial hair. I'll also leave a link in the description so you can click and purchase it if you want to. And these are three that I highly recommend that I use myself and I've been using for years and I love. Ciao.